Hey y'all, it's us jam. Just in time to see Twix. Um I have no idea what last time I made a video was. Um I've really been slacking off on that. Oh, I knew if I stuck that there she was gonna knock it over and move it. Silly Twix. Um but yeah, not too much going on. I'm very busy. Um, as always. This month has been a crazy month and it's uh it's, yeah, it's just been crazy. Um I've been dealing with some uh added stress, some crap that's going on, but like I've said in the other videos, it's, it'll work itself out, hopefully, um, either way, there's going to be, uh, I don't know what to say, um, either way, it's going to kind of suck, it's going to be how bad it's going to suck, basically, so, it's more one of those things to get over more than hope for the best for it, um, so, yeah, anyways, uh, work's going pretty well, uh, we're pretty busy today, um, well, today I I did absolutely nothing, but a few things um, because me and a couple engineers and uh, another guy who want they wanted to get trained is getting trained on my machine. It's not like I said, it's not none of the machines are their own, but it's a machine that I always run if there's stuff to run. So my machine basically. Um, setting up a new part for uh, a big uh, transmission company in the states um, it's a pretty big contract so looking forward to that it's a really big piece of um, uh, a really big part that we're making it's pretty big so that has been interesting it's kind of been my first experience with running a new part on a machine it's very tedious and it's very like it's mentally exhausting because you're constantly having to think and you know, you always got to be making some adjustments and think of logically how to do this and that. So, um, it is a very good practice for me, though, for sure. I've I've gotten a million percent better at the, running that machine. I never even knew how to set up a machine for three years there. Almost, you know, I lip and it's bugging me. Um, and now I know how to run a couple, and well, I know how to run a lot of them, but I know how to set up um, a couple now. Twitch sticks sitting up like a person looking out the window. Okay. Well, of course she'll stop. She knows I'm videotaping her. Wait, Gigi. Whoa, she's talking to me. Um, sorry, I'm totally out of it as far as videos go. This is really nothing to really report. It's like the same thing happens every day of the week. Tomorrow I have tutoring. Um, not honestly, not looking forward to it. I don't know, my tutors are starting to really kind of annoy me, because, uh, there's really, we're only on, like, four units of, into my book, and I mean, I have a test in a few weeks on, like, the first five, and, uh, you know, after that it goes quite quickly, like, this is a month of tutoring, we're only on five, so, I mean, we can't keep at that pace, so, but the biggest thing is he's really pushing me to be able to do mul num big numbers in my head, which is a great thing, but we just really don't have the time for it. I'm allowed to use a calculator at work, I use a calculator at school. To me, I really just don't see the point in it at this point in my life to be able to multiply a million by freaking 200 or something, you know what I mean? Well, that's really easy to come in with 200 million, but um, you know what I mean? Like huge numbers, like 500 into like plus like 349, like he'll make it all these weird, stupid numbers, which aren't that difficult to do, but he wants me to be like on the second, like, he says it, and I know it, like, that, it's never gonna happen for me, so, he needs to realize that, sooner or later, um, we canceled last week again, because it's twice this month we canceled, because our days just didn't work out this week, last week I had stuff going on, he had stuff going on, so, we're down a week, two weeks on that, so, um, hopefully tomorrow we will do something else, um, and see how that goes. He wanted me to practice and practice all these numbers and stuff, but I just, I just do not have the time. Like I really don't. I have really tried to sit um, around and do uh, oh, crap, do some math stuff. I read through my next chapter. And it's looking pretty good with him. I'll be able to do it. And I looked online, watched some tutorial videos on how to do certain things, and they're really making sense. So I'm feeling pretty confident. Hopefully he's not. He doesn't get angry with me or anything, but he gets he gets really pushy that he wants me to know. He'll say things like, oh, if you want to do this line of work, you have to be very quick with your numbers and stuff. I'm like, dude, I can use a calculator at school, at work, 
any freaking time I need one. So I just got really frustrated with that. And he's like, well, if you can do it in your head, it's blah, blah, blah. And, you know, I totally agree with him, but, I mean, I don't have six years to learn two units, okay? So I need to kind of push him along even. Um, but, you know, I was struggling the last two weeks to, because since I started working late, I get home at like 5 right now. I sit down at 5, it comes at 5.30. I've had a 10-hour day of looking at a screen, thinking numbers in my head, all that stuff, and I have to come home and do it again for another two hours almost. So it's frustrating, and uh, my head hasn't been in the game because of drama and some unforeseen stuff going on in my life right now that's very stressful on top of school and working late and everything else. So it's uh, definitely been taking a hit on my mental capacity um, as far as uh, tutoring goes. So I'm thinking this week it should be a little better because last tutoring session that stuff was still kind of really new and just happening. And the week before that I canceled because it was just too much. So I'm hoping this week my brain, I can get it, my brain intact for that tomorrow and try to stay positive and focused. So I will try my best for that and I'll see how that goes. I probably won't be around tomorrow, but Anyways, other than that, um, nothing much is going on. We've had some great weather, just perfect room temperature, warm, mild weather for the past two weeks, and it's not going to continue all week. You know, high teens to mid-20s Celsius, it's, it's been really, really nice. So I can't complain about that. We've had a relatively nice summer, not too many scorching hot days. Um, I may be going out with my cousin tonight, hang out for a bit. Um, Oh, also new in the news, like a big thing, I'm seeing someone now, so it's kind of exciting. Um, she lives in uh, a city away. <clears throat> no, we actually dated very briefly about four years ago when we were a lot younger and kind of immature, so giving it a whirl again and uh, talking a lot on the phone and texting and all that stuff, so it's going well so far. It's been like not even a week, so... <laughs> no parties or anything yet. Um, I do want to get out there. She's going to try to get here. We both have a lot of bad things going on in our life and a lot of good things. and just, just very busy, but we decided to commit to it and, uh, you know, just take it slow and see how it goes. And Yeah, I got nothing else. Anyways, it's all doing well, and uh, we'll see if Twix has anything to say. Twix, do you like to say anything? She's if you can hear, she's complaining. So you can turn this fan off if you can hear you better. Twix! 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 Oh, I'll get it back. She'll start talking. Twixie! Twix! You want some food? Is there no food? What's the matter? Are you grumpy? She was going on sob in the kitchen a few minutes ago. And now she's all mad out of here. Twix! Twix! Twix, what are you doing? Where's the food? Where's your food? Oh, that one usually gets there all the time. Where's your toys? Oh, where's your food? Where's your food? You getting your toys? We got a few out of her. Before, like, every time I would say anything to her, she'd be like, That's her complaining now. Right, Twix? Complain. Twix, <laughs> Are you doing a good baby? Okay, anyways, she's probably just mad because I'm not giving her enough attention after work, so. Say bye bye. Oh, no, not that for her. Anyways, see you later. Bye.